all angles, but the fact that these type of ones have some thick ones and then they have some apathy over there. Yeah, it goes over there. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, this. Puerto Rico in general is a subduction zone. So, when you think about earthquakes, you think about New Zealand, Japan, mm -hmm. um, Alaska. These are the types of systems you should be thinking about when you think about Puerto Rico. Mm -hmm. Um, Puerto Rico has, is, has earthquakes because of the collision of the North American plate with the Caribbean plate. Mm -hmm. And we're in the middle of a deformation zone that stretches from the Puerto Rico trench north of the island mm -hmm. to the Martha's Trail, which is south of here. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know how rare this is in terms of world earthquakes, but it's a really interesting earthquake sequence because we normally you'd have one main shock and then a whole bunch of smaller earthquakes fading away. This seems to keep on going, and we've had a magnitude 5.8, a magnitude 6.4, and a magnitude 6, so we've had at least three um, you know, moderate-sized earthquakes, and that's different than the usual sequence. And this also seems to be jumping between faults, which is also really interesting.